Today's lunch is New Orleans inspired. Chef John from the Cutting Edge Classroom is showing us how to make muffalettas. Perfect. Oh, right she there. She got it. I think she I can just it. eat the bread by itself. Yeah, but that's it looks not pretty what we're good. Do today, right? <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> what we is have a muffaletta. Well, a muffaletta is um, it's a, the signature sandwich of New Orleans, and it was brought to that area by immigrants from Italy back in the early 1900s. So uh, if you go to New Orleans, you're going to end up having one of these sooner or later. Nice. At least you this should is anyway. Before you have the, uh, uh, the little yeah. powdered beignet, right? <laughs> exactly what it is. All right. How do we get started? Okay, so we have a round loaf of Italian bread, mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to just cut that open. That is like the biggest piece of bread I've ever seen. It is. <laughs> this is not one sandwich. It makes multiple, for most people anyway. So we're going to open that up and then just take a little bit of the interior out. Okay, kind of making like a little yeah, bit of a mini bowl there. That's it. That's the idea. And then we have a, a tapenade, and the recipe's online, but this has olives in it. Uh, roasted peppers, Ooh. garlic, o olive oil, vinegar, uh, just a variety of That's kind of your juices different there. stuff. Oh yeah, this is the good so stuff. So you layer that all the way on the bottom just layer Just lay there. it out in there. Okay. Yeah. How much, you know, is that like a handful? Uh, I've got about a cup and a half there okay. for this sandwich, roughly. Then some mozzarella cheese. Mm -hmm. You could use sliced or this. This is a smoked, shredded. And then I have some provolone. More cheese. <laughs> More cheese. Load this it is up. smoked, f smoke flavored provolone. Ooh. And you have a couple different meat selections. As I well. do. Are we going to put all those on? We're going to lay them all on there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got uh, salami. Yeah. This is just hard salami. We've got capicola, which is this one right here. Capicola. This is another Italian lunch meat. Okay. And we've got supersata, which is my touch. It doesn't normally go on there, but this is another Italian lunch meat that's, that's really like. good. Uh, we've got mortadella. This is kind of the Italian version of bologna. You can see it's getting really big. I'm impressed. I thought some of that was just for, for display, yeah. but it's going on the sandwich. I think I got it all on there, right? <laughs> okay, so we're good. And then I go with back more. On top. Yep. This goes back on there. Just spread it on. And smell it. The olives. And the garlic, yes. the garlic. It's good stuff. Now this sandwich would normally be pressed. And the way you would do that is you would put it on a pan, set another pan on top, and then you would put a cast iron pan and it would press it down and then you refrigerate it for about an hour and a half. Okay. That lets all the flavors come in and it gets easier to cut too. But we'll and try it. So I'm just gonna just give it a it quick yourself? press. Yeah. Use the muscles. And I think I'll just cut it into four to yeah, make it Yeah, I want to see what the inside looks like, the layers. Yeah, I don't want to run out of time on it, so let's see. That wasn't the easiest thing to cut through, so there wow. it is. There it is, the muffaletta. Beautiful. 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 Thank you, Lunch. Chef John, no problem. for taking My us pleasure. a little trip down to New Orleans. Thanks. We appreciate it. Thanks for having me. <laughs> well, would you rather get a raise or a big bonus? What do you think? Uh, I like both. <laughs> I know, I like both too. <laughs>